hello guys welcome to the current series of jmeter tutorials so in this video we're going to learn about how we can record a script using blaze meter chrome extension this is pretty simple and we need few things to use it so let us just discuss those things so first of all you would need a chrome browser right secondly you need a scenario which needs to be recorded right and blaze meter account and blaze meter extension so these are the things that we need so let us just quickly start with it and over here the first thing is just a second yeah so the first thing is we need to start jmeter now over here this is our uh, let's say jmeter instance right i'll click on new and this is done okay do one thing you don't need anything from it right now so it's simply you can just ignore it and go to the chrome browser right now we are already done with these things and we'll be starting with this particular part right so over here what you have to do is that simply look for something that is blaze meter for chrome right now here you can see that the first link is this that is the chrome.google.com which is the official link of google um, say chrome store right and here it will take you to this page right simply do one thing click on add or add to chrome and it will take a little bit time for this to install once done you can start using it so click on add extension and once the extension has been added that will show up over here in the top right as you can see that this is over here now right and you are done with it right now the next thing is you need to use a blaze meter account right so over here if you go there right you need you need to see this you can see this option that is login and sign up now if you don't have a login id you can quickly you know, simply click on sign up button and you can sign up over here the account is totally free they don't charge you anything for this right so if you click on the login button they will take you to this particular page where you have to provide your credentials right so over here my mail id is this just from trainings right and my password is this let me just log in right and over here yeah so we are done now we can start working with the test right so skip this wizard if you get this kind of wizard right now over here we are logged in so we can start working with the test now i can see that it is showing my name if it is already showing your name this means that you have already logged into your blaze meter account right now the thing is you would want to record things right you would want to record a scenario so let us just have some kind of scenario with us what i'll do i'll simply start the recorder here now right and here i would open redif.com so the page is opening it will take a little bit time then you can see that it has recorded few things then what i'll do i'll simply add a step and here i'll add the step as say money right add step and here we'll click on money so this is done and here we are doing few things then here what i did i added one more thing that is portfolio so i looked for this i'll add the step and i'll click on my portfolio right so there are few things which have got recorded right let me just stop recording this thing now now over here as you can see that it is processing this thing now and it will take a little bit time for the processing to be done once done we can see the file which is being generated right and here it takes a little bit time sometimes 
so it was still going on and here it has not shown me anything yet let us just see whether we have got anything over here or not home projects recent projects default nothing is there but if you notice something if you open it you can see that there was the test already there right so what it does is it saves the test over here now the thing is you would want to save this test now what kind of file you would want it right so here you can do is you can download the jmeter jmx file here again there are few things that is say uh, you, what are the things that you would want to be in your project right so i just want this domain to be included that is redup.com i don't want any other things click on save and you can see that it will give you this prompt that is it is exporting to jmx once done the file will be downloaded just drag and drop this file to gmeter right so over here this file has been loaded these are the things that have been used right and if you notice something here if i show you so you can see that this was the request right then redif money money.redif.com right then portfolio right so over here portfolio.redif.com so these are the things that it is doing right it is doing the same work that we used to do in say automated recorder that is http script recorder this is also a automated recording but the thing is that there are few things different so in case if you facing issues with hsts you can simply make use of this blaze meter extension which would help you to record things in a easy way right now as you have recorded this you can run these requests as well and you can go with and go ahead with these right so th this is how you can record scripts using blaze meter chrome extension thank you and uh, please guys don't forget to uh, say sh uh, put on comments if you have any queries you can feel free to post comments over here so we have the comments section you can scroll down and you can put your comments whatever comments you have if you uh, if you have any queries you can feel free to ask over here thank you now the next video after this is bad boy tool so we'll be learning bad boy in the next video and okay